The rising tensions over Ukraine, Vladimir Putin breaking his silence tonight, accusing the U.S. and NATO of ignoring Russia's latest security concerns and criticizing NATO's presence in Eastern Europe and saying, quote, they played us. Here's our senior foreign correspondent, Ian Panel from Ukraine. Tonight, as more U.S. military aid arrives in Ukraine, Russian President Vladimir Putin accusing America and the West of ignoring its security concerns. The Russian leader saying the response to their three key demands, especially the expansion of NATO eastwards, is inadequate. Putin complaining they said one thing and did another. As the people say, they played us, simply lied. The U.S. rejecting this, calling these concerns an attempt to bully Ukraine. Ukraine's defense minister tweeting about the new military supplies. Six bird from our friends from the U.S. 84 tons of ammunition arrived. Earlier, Secretary of State Blinken speaking with Russian Foreign Minister Lavrov, saying it was time for Russia to start withdrawing its troops from the border. No breakthrough, but the two agreeing to talk again. The door to diplomacy remains open. Uh, we don't know what decision President Putin will make while we've seen the buildup of troops on the border. David, for now, the diplomacy seems very much alive with more talks planned. That's the good news. The less good is that the fundamental differences remain as do those Russian troops on the borders. And soon some more will arrive for these large scale war games in Belarus. So diplomacy ahead, yes, but also dangers. David. Ian Panel in Ukraine for us again tonight. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.